eyes with a lurch. And you are not in your bed. You stand above a body which is in a state of gore nearly beyond recognition. The body of that scared girl who asked for nothing more than a night of shelter. Her blood covers you, and its warmth feels like the embrace of an old friend. You recall nothing of how you ended up here, but your head pounds and aches. No matter how it appears, the body is there, and her blood is on your hands. The question flows through your mind. Who are you, really, that you could be guilty of such bitter business? The little worm seems silent. Your companions sleep blissfully tonight. If it were the rage of a tadpole, no others seem to be affected. You don't have much time for reflection now. You need to act. You may only have a few moments before the others awaken and begin to cast blame for the hot sin before you. A light and delicate girl. There should be no trouble at all to toss her into a ditch. You roll her away further bloodying your hands as you do. In lumbering style, you have gotten away with murder. <laughs> 